Corporation performed its first approach and landing free flight test of the Dream Chaser spacecraft October 26. We have SEP arms and change mode ready. Three, two, one, release, release, release. Good release. The vehicle successfully released from its carrier aircraft, an Ericsson air crane helicopter, as planned at approximately 11.10 a.m. Pacific. Following release, Dream Chaser's automated flight control system steered the vehicle to its intended glide slope. The vehicle adhered to the designed flight trajectory throughout the flight profile. Less than a minute later, Dream Chaser smoothly flared and touched down on Edwards Air Force Base's runway 22L, right on centerline. While there was an anomaly with the left landing gear deployment, the high quality flight and telemetry data throughout all of the critical phases of this approach and landing test will allow Sierra Nevada Corporation teams to continue to refine their spacecraft design.